rock out to live music, but don't want to leave your house? Well, Daily Planet has got you covered. Well, Saturday, back in January, we rolled up into the center of Cambridge, just 6.30 in the morning, so still dark, no one knew what was going on. Our guys delivered the piano, we set it up, and at 7 o'clock, we turned it on. The reaction we got was absolutely phenomenal. I don't think one person walked past without stopping, smiling, laughing, pulling out their phone, taking a photo, taking selfies. We had people sit down, they pretended to play along. We had couples come up and just start dancing out the front. We want to bring the joy of live music in the best way possible to as many people as possible, and that's what we do. Ross Norman has music in his bones. Our family has always enjoyed music, going back through the generations. My grandfather gave me my first, here's what a piano looks like kind of lesson. 40 years ago, Ross's grandfather quit his job as a physicist to make pianos. I guess he noticed um, that piano was kind of viewed as this untouchable, complex machine. But with his training and his ability to take things back to root principles, he realized that some very small changes, such as just the felt that's on the hammer, such as maybe just the balance point, the striking point, just some very subtle changes make a very big difference. They now make some of the finest hand-built pianos money can buy, with at least 250 hours of craftsmanship going into each one. Somewhere along the way, their customers wanted more. A lot of our clients can't play the piano. Um, in fact, the majority of our clients can't play the piano. But a piano is the most fantastic piece of furniture. It's an amazing piece of art. It's a centerpiece to any room. And that was where our client base was going. Where they were going was back to the 19th century, the heyday for self-playing pianos, also called pianolas. The traditional pianola operated off a bellow system using air and um, firing through effectively holes in the piece of paper. That meant that through the complexities of bellows and cogs and chains and cams and levers, the right note eventually played. However, the note played as one sound. You just, it was, it was a note, there was, no, there was no nuance to it, there was no definition of touch from one note to the next. It was very much a case of... Just, just plonk, plonk, plonk. With the Edelweiss self-play system, everything's been taken just to a whole new level. That's thanks to electromagnetic technology. This is actually a solenoid rail from one of our Edelweiss self-playing pianos. You can see the solenoids taking their time as they burst up and down. This is what we call the 48-hour play-in. We make sure every piano has had a bit like a road test of a car. The magic behind the mystery is really very simple. This is a sample one our technicians made. So if, as a pianist, I'd be hitting the key from this end, causing the hammer to strike the string. With the self-play system, the solenoid hits the key from underneath, but uses exactly the same mechanism to make a live, real, acoustic piano sound. We have um, three different strengths set up as preset examples, playing very softly, playing at a medium strength, and then playing what we would call as a pianist fortissimo, which is pretty much with everything the pianist has got to muster as he plays the keys. Each solenoid across the entire piano rail can deliver more than a 1,000 gradations of touch. This means we can perfectly recreate the virtuoso experience. You can go to the much more soft and mellow kind of music, but again, it can turn around and it can still do very flat out rock and roll. And that's all available within the aid of our cell play system. The pianos can also record any performance with incredible precision. Our record function would be a strip that sits along the entire length of the key bed. I'm just under the front edge of the keys here. Um, that would mean that as I press the key, it's using infrared technology to record how far down that key's being pressed, how fast it's getting to that point of its deepest compression, and that then records how hard the key's being played and correspondingly relates to the sound that's heard as that key is played. And we then connect that up to our computer. Using the programs, it converts it into a MIDI file, which can then be read um, by the solenoid rail and play back in absolute perfection. The Edelweiss self-playing piano comes with 450 songs. It upgrades to 960 songs, and their website is always being updated. It works very simply. Running off an iPod or iPad wirelessly, you simply connect to the piano's own router. It comes with its own micro Wi-Fi network, if that makes sense. Uh, connect to the piano's router, select the song you'd like to play off on your iPad, and just simply hit play. And it remains a piano for anyone who might want to play along and I can just be playing away, and the piano will just kick in underneath me, and we can just carry on playing. 
there's, there's, there's no way on here I can hit the piano as hard as I like. There's no way I'm going to hurt any of the solenoids. I can even still operate the pedal. Should something go wrong, fixing faulty solenoids only takes a few minutes. Replacing them isn't too bad. The worst part probably is taking this off the piano. The piano is on its legs and, well, you have to work on your back taking this off. It's, it's quite hard, but, well, doable. <laughs> Ross can even work his magic on traditional pianos, retrofitting them to play too. Once we've installed the self-play system into the piano, we need to take some time to calibrate that to make sure it's playing perfectly. Because of the variation in every piano, because of the slight variation in every keyboard, the calibration for every piano is very individual. Eight of Us is about as close as you can get to bringing a live music concert into your own environment, be it your house, be it a hotel, be it a restaurant, be it a club. It's about bringing the joy of live music, bringing the real experience to you.